Okay. Welcome back to RimWorld Rise of the Machines. Uh, yeah, you find us right in the midst of sort of chaos here, an aftermath of a battle. And I had to pause it just right here, right as it ended, because it was just like, holy shit, that was epic. It was kind of like the, the jump pack into turret range stuff. We're just like, fuck yeah, I did it, yeah! So what had happened was... I got raided by the Shattered Empire. The... The Empire. With all their advanced shit. They were planning to, uh, mortar... It was sort of weird, they were planning to mortar... My base. And... They set up shop here. But then it seems like they never got shipped the materials. Because um, they, they drop ship in, like, food and materials and stuff so they can start mortaring me. That never happened. So eventually, after a few days, they're like, fuck it. We'll just attack them. So then they started and just launched an offensive on me. And originally I was like, okay, well, Harper is basically a melee god at this point. <laughs> and I'm fairly convinced of that. He, he, I mean, there's a lot of improvements still to be made. Um, But he's wearing riot armor. He's got the shield belt. And he's got the plasma sword, which is actually breaking. Uh, which is kind of a bummer. Um, He's got 20 melee skill. And pretty much he can just slaughter anything that comes across his path. It's great. Like, zombies are never an issue at this point until, I the sword breaks. So I was like, all right, they're going to come in. I'm just going to post up with Harper here, and he'll just slaughter them as they come in. Unfortunately, the shield belt, well, good, uh, cannot handle a whole team of assault rifles and stuff. So that didn't work. Reloaded. And I was like, okay, I can't get these traps online in time. And the traps didn't even seem to bother them. Like, really? They were just stepping over them like it was nothing. So I was like, all right, what else do I got? Napalm. I got napalm. We can make this work. Um, I tried it once. Failed. Basically, I was too slow. Um, but the first time, I didn't have much napalm on hand. So the first time I did it, I basically did like a single line through here. Uh, but I just didn't get it done in time. It was too slow, blah, blah, blah. So then I'm like, all right, fuck it. Just do a double line all up through this corridor. And we had the spark grid set up. We had the power switch. And uh, they came in. A couple of them were faster than the others. So Harper was kind of holding them off. And then the majority of them got in here. I hit the switch and just boom. Oh, man. Fucking roasted them. It was beautiful. And there you go. We all survived. So, yeah. Uh, I'm hoping to make a lot more napalm. And then basically just line the entire thing here with napalm. And that should deal with stuff. <laughs> okay. So. I don't think we want to capture anybody. Uh, there's no androids here or anything. Fire mage. Yeah, well, I'm a fucking napalm mage. I think all we really want to do is just strip them, because they're wearing, like, nice, full empire kind of gear. Recon armor, recon helmets, riot helmets. It's all good. So go ahead and strip him. Strip him. Okay, now finish him off. Strip him. Finish him off. Well, there was an android in there, but I killed him. Uh, fire. Let's 
Okay, well, you guys can all hop through that. Uh, finish off. He's gonna do a death rattle because he's a fire mage. I feel like he's probably gonna explode. Let's go ahead and back up. Yep. All that shit. All right. Whew. Uh, right, so we can flip this switch. Spark grid keeps trying to start stuff on fire. There you go. Okay, so yeah. That was pretty sweet. Um, aside from that, we did get machining. So we've got a machining table, we've got a loading bench for making ammo. Uh, which is all well and good, but obviously I'm more interested in turrets than actually equipping my guys with guns. Um, oil production is going pretty well. Fairly well. Why does this not have power? Oh, we probably lost... No. Hmm. Oh, yeah, there it is. That died. Yeah, if I'm gonna light this all fucking on fire, just do that. Anyways, uh, so oil is going mostly well. We sort of uh, drained this one out. So it's going to very slowly regenerate. Um, so I've got this one going, but even this one, like, capacity is not that big. So now I've got this one going, but the capacity for that one is not that big. Uh, compared to, like, this is 57,000. I mean, that's massive. It's just in the mountain. 44,000, 29,000. So it's almost not worth it to just go for a 9,000 capacity. This is 26,000. Maybe I should go for this instead. It's near this anima tree. Yeah, hey, you know what? Cancel that. Um, as for traps, maybe leave this first initial row. But the rest will all be napalm. Now that we don't have zombies constantly milling around, you know, we can uh, set up our kill box a bit more properly. Uh, I guess eventually it'd be good to have like a ranged kill box where you kind of have like a funnel and then you have all your ranged turrets and stuff on uh, one end of the funnel and then they move into the threshold and just get gunned down. Bottleneck them and blow them up. But napalm is fun. Not gonna argue with that. Just mine this all out, I guess. 
Okay. Um, what am I working on now? Oh, the multi analyzer. Yeah, multi analyzer is big. Gets us all sorts of fun stuff. Um, I got the high tech research bench because a lot of techs are they require it. We're gunning for tier two androids because that'll be a nice upgrade over tier one. I don't know if I can. I don't know if I can upgrade tier one, or if I just have to make new tier twos. Um, but having some tier ones around is not horrible. All right, so this is all napalm. And I don't have enough stored at this point, but we'll eventually want this whole thing. Because that, I mean, it's just nothing's going to really survive that. I also need to take the time to make my fucking mechanoid effigies. So expensive, though. Two per colonist. So that's 100 plasteel per colonist. Just to avoid... Mechanoids. Once I can make plasteel, that's sort of... A group of corgis is passing through the... <laughs> fucking rim world. Sure. Big group of corgis. Ten of them. Anyways. Once I can make Plasteel, everything's great. But who knows when that'll be. Alright, this dude's waiting to be painted. There you go. Prisoners aren't working. Yeah, he is. Yeah, she is. I'm making a lot of big sculptures because we never get traitors. He's up to nine crafting now, so that's not bad. Look at him go, though. It's just a sight to behold. But yeah, I mean, I was just really pleased to be able to deal with uh, a raid by the Empire without, you know, dev commands or anything. Androids persevered. We got a bunch of chem root growing just for free chem fuel because we can, uh, can shove chem fuel into this storage tank to turn into napalm and stuff. Okay, we want to... It's probably easier to just deconstruct this. Rather than actually moving it. Uh, I don't know if I can... Okay. Yeah, that's... Shit. We have just... Uh... Right. Ah, perfect. Good, good. Pipeline. Good. Yep, yep. Power. Same thing. Good, good, good. Oh yeah, I got a hollow deck. So Harper uses it for fun. So like I think it also raises skills or something like that. Pretty interesting. Fuck. Actually, Harper can deal with that. That's nothing. Watch this shit.
And yeah, it sets them on fire because it's a plasma sword. And then they're dead. Easy peasy lemon squeeze. Pretty good, huh? Don't have to worry about that shit no more. Till the plasma sword breaks. <laughs> there actually, I think, is a. I don't think I. I didn't go for it. There's a mending research you can do where you can research uh, a bench that lets you repair equipment. That would probably be very beneficial. Now, why are you still saying you don't have power? Oh, because. Fee. Fee. Get that online. We need oil. We need so much oil. Oil is life. Did someone do it? Anyone? Anyone? Anyone do it? Do I have to force some? I have to force someone to do it. Ooh, free steel. Hell yeah. Where's my music? Someone is working on this. This guy, Reed. He's, he's on it. He's on the project. It's very slow, but he's on it. Oh, this should also all be hauled. No, not the zebra. Oh, no. Actually, they're coming for Harper Jr. That's bad. Where's Harper non Jr.? Away. He's away. Fuck. Fuck. Why did you go that way? Okay, his... He must... He's riot shield and stuff. He's loaded. He's fully protected. Waited, waits for daddy to come help. Perfect. All right, we got 27 zombies. You have... I have more ammo than that. Here. But I can't carry any more ammo. Hmm. And he's my best shot, other than Harper. Uh, okay. They're gonna enrage once enough of them gather up there. And they'll tear down the door. And that's all she wrote. Okay. Uh, I don't know. I don't really want use up the plasma sword that much. It's like one hit per kill, though. Are you awaiting... Oh. Robert? Do that. Oh, there they all died off. Uh, okay, good. Good, 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 good. And now we need to uh, drill this one. And I figured out, of course, the skill associated with that. It's drill, which I thought was for actually 
drilling for metal, but it seems that the oil well also uses that specifically for this process. I, I guess it makes sense. Jarvis is still pretty happy. There was a prison break at some point where the other guy that I captured, he got killed because Harper just walked in with his plasma sword and was like, enough of this. <laughs> but um, this should probably be rectified. Robert, you want to? Go clear this blockage. But yeah, Jarvis still going strong. Just making art. I've got 20 here. because I mean, I could just keep sitting forever. Just, that's your life. I guess, I mean, she loves art, right? She's got a clear passion for art. So, I think there are worse prison sentences. And she believes in the android supremacy, so, you know. The only problem is she has to eat nutrient paste all the time. Oh, and insects in there as well. Yeah, well, yeah, well. Not having fun here, nobody seems to respect you. Well, you're a prisoner. You will never be one of us unless I put your mind into an android's body. We'll see about that. Uh, machine party expected. 46%. So technically, the only other person in my religion is the prisoner. None of these tier ones can have a religion. Um, Alright, fuck it. Let's have the party. Fun machine party. Herb World Chef. Herb World Chef. Problem with this screen is you can never tell if it's an android or not. I, I assume not. Reject. We make our friends here. Yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah, it's it's going pretty well. Overall, I'm quite pleased. I think, you know, we're not doing the automation stuff and all that as much as I wanted to. It's kind of hard to get into with semi-random research. Station security named Tanner. I don't know. Again, it doesn't sound... Let me just see. Oh, it was an android! Tier 2! Yeah! And he's a great shot! Yeah! Alright. Except he doesn't do any skilled labor. Well, that's okay. I got a lot of dumb labor you can do. You can clean and you can shoot people. How's that sound? Uh, I think we probably want my other honey badger. Unless I gave that away. I might have sold it. Okay. Oh, there it is. Get that. You're gonna like it. Alright, so, uh, yeah, you're gonna do this stuff. You can be a jailer. Um, 
not much with animals. Uh, you could hunt if I ever deem that that's important. And you can do all this stuff. Mainly hauling and cleaning. Good, good, good. I think we might have gotten the mineral scanner. Or is that what I was working? No. Maybe I... No, I guess I didn't. I passed on that. All right, anyway. So this is, uh... Okay, it's going up. Why is this going up? Why is this going up? going up because it's not pumpy. Ah, that's why. Nothing horrible with it going up. This one we're going to be able to run for quite a long time. Barb Slinger. Extreme Wargs. Duchess of the Shattered Empire. Oh, you want me to help the Shattered Empire? Actually, it's not the worst idea. I don't know how I ended up pissing off the Shattered Empire. But 64 Goodwill should take me out of enemy range. And it's only nine wargs. Tanner can uh, do his security job. Bioengineering supplier coming in. Sylvester was my trader with eight social, but he somehow got his voice synthesizer cut out. So he cannot speak. Um, so Harper has to do everything, as usual. I can buy some bugs, including a vat-grown milk beetle. Mmm. Yummy. It can mine. That's kind of interesting. And then you get genetic material, which can mutate humans. Bioengineering incubator. All right, never mind. Uh, Tanner, did you get a bunch of ammo? You didn't. You know you need ammo to fire upon things, right? Hmm. As I cycle through and... I should really build a weapon cabinet. No... No, maybe I don't have any 300. Who's got the other honey badger? Three. Are you carrying? You're carrying all of it. Well, that's just not allowed, Reed. That's just, that's just not allowed. You can now your inventory is full because you're carrying 18. Well, are you a hoarder or something? What is this? Okay, well that's all you get. All right, his gear. Okay, so he's just holding on to all of it. That that's good. Reload. Good. And let's build a weapons locker. Um, I don't think I have enough. No. Uranium. I do have quite a bit of uranium. Bucket. Yeah. 
stuff will get stored in there. Sylvester is waiting for a paint job. Uh, Robert's working on that. Wargs should be arriving. Yep. Oh, boy, right there. Well, shit. Tanner is pretty far. And they're going to just start moving in. So I think the plasma sword has to come out. Fucking dead? I mean, yeah, I don't expect them all to be like fucking Harper, but oh. Well, that was probably not worth it. Although, again, he was a tier one. We can make a billion of them if we want. You might as well come get the better gun. <laughs> Sad to say. Oh, a mining trader. All right, well, hold on. Harper's drilling. What is happening here? Where did this thing come from? A great devourer. Not very resilient and easily dispatched. Well, Tanner gets uh, to try something. Here we go. Full auto. <laughs> well, it was right. All right, anyways. Uh, Harper recharging his battery. Then he's going to call this mining company. What you got? What you got? What you got? You got loads of steel? I like that. You got loads of plast steel? I like that. M fuel? I could just buy all that. Um, Gold? 75. And uh, I could sell them all my uranium. No, maybe leave. I don't know exactly what it's used for, so do that. Done. Now, that was a lot of money. I know. <laughs> but I have a lot of things to sell. I've got 21 art pieces here, 22 on the way. Um... And I've got a lot of smoke leaf. I have a lot of smoke leaf. That just no one ever makes into joints. But I also have 115 joints, 265 cigarettes. You know, there's... There's things to... Someone eventually... Who's on drugs? Rob... Roberto. Roberto is... Roberto also does a lot of other things. Uh, What was I doing? What was I doing? What was I doing? I was thinking. I was thinking... I was thinking of something. There were thoughts in my... Br Actually, you can... Oh! Right, I was going to put a new orbital trade beacon in here so I can sell all this art. Got a hostile faction coming through. They're not going to bother me.
Yeah, okay. Slowly but surely. Um, but yeah, I, buying steel is just kind of important. Um, I can get scanning and then I can start, you know, deep, deep drilling for it, but I don't know. Right now it's just easier to buy a lot of it. And plast steel, obviously. Everything I want to do, sort of the end game involves plast steel. Very close on this well. It's good. It's good because this is almost running out. Once this is up, I'll turn off this well, let that recharge. Ideally, I have two going at once, because we have a lot of oil needs. But you know, you can't get blood from a stone and all that. Alright, this is online, that's perfect. I'll flip this off. Uh, and I bought chem fuel, didn't I? Did that go anywhere specifically other than right here? I guess maybe that's all I bought. All right, uh, well, throw that in there. Oh, wait, that's the pump. Don't do that. The siphon. There you go. That's good enough. Okay. I think we can probably start producing napalm and synthlene again. Causing some power fluctuation. Drains the shit out of your chem fuel to make all this. I mean, I, I've been building up chem fuel for days and days. Oh, uh, new research. We have multi analyzer, so we'll have to put that in. Um, fire, you know, fire sprinkler is probably not the worst idea, but mending. There we go. And also get into advanced computing, which will lead to nuclear power and mechanite assembling, launch systems, nerve shock delivery. It's all very exciting, but we need power. We need plasma sword back online. Yeah, the mechanoids. I mean, once I get effigies online, it doesn't really... I don't really care. I don't really care if they land and take over the planet, except for me. Presumably. But, um... Yeah, you know. They're out there. 
Tanner turned out to be an enemy agent. Oh, man. He was tier two. He was a bro. Why did he pick that moment to become a traitor? Well, I don't want to waste the whole batch of napalm on him. Uh, I guess it's going to be Harper. Triggered a couple traps. He's almost dead as it is. Now, Harper Jr., have some fucking sense in your head. He's not even using the sword. He doesn't even have it equipped. Why did you drop the sword? Sylvester, you have a gun. No. Yeah, you do. Yeah, yeah, you do. Where are you? Get out here with your gun. Oh, you have no ammo. I forgot. Horse. Uh, all right. Well, you've got a riot shield. Can you just use that? This is fucking painful. Sylvester, can't you just go pick up some ammo? For the love of God. Uh, all right. Then you gotta get. Then you gotta ditch it. I got 7.6239 millimeter. Uh, does that fit anything? Uh, yeah, that, this, this. Go, go get this. Okay, good. And now shoot this motherfucker. Problem solved. Now get the honey badger. Alright, now my question is, what the fuck happened to your plasma sword? No, it's not in there. I don't see it anywhere. I don't see it anywhere. Did it disintegrate? Maybe it did when I was fighting the wards. I think it did disintegrate at some point. Or I got disarmed? I get, no, it would be out here. No, I think it disintegrated. Well, that sucked. Ugh, where the fuck am I going to get another plasma sword? You know? Uh, okay, well... Problem for another day, I guess. I don't know if I would have picked Mending then, in that case. I'm gonna hold off on making it another Tier 1. I'm hoping to see Tier 2 pop up very soon. Don't suppose you have Plat... No. The fabled plasma sword. It's so beautiful. Perilous clutch mother here. 
Cassandra Classic, ready to go. Yeah, the Clutch Mother. Well, no Plasma Sword. All right, I guess we'll have Sylvester give it a try. What have I got to lose? I don't want to shoot this. Don't want to shoot. Stop it! I don't want to stop it! I don't want to shoot you, cheetah! Fuck! Okay, got it good. Okay, I don't think we need to. All right, sure. Well, that was easy. Guns are good, huh? Remember? Remember guns being good? Why is it you go through that whole path? You can step over the napalm. Doesn't hurt you. Like, seriously, he doesn't want to go through the napalm. I guess they just, like, if they have to, they will, but... Let's see, like, right there he is. Large infestation. Yeah. That's a little bit more problematic. What are my options there? Do I have any flamethrowers or something? No. I mean, I could just start shooting. It's cramped, though. It's cramped. I'm not sure. And if we let that fester, it's going to be like what happened last time when I had to dev command all of it. And I'd really rather not do that. Rocket launcher. What is this? Smart pistol. That's cool. Why are you struggling to have water? I guess we're just using up constantly a lot of water. Napalm is only used for two things as far as I know, and that's... Um... Napalm trail and then a napalm bomb, but the napalm bomb has to be placed and then detonated. It can't be like lobbed in. So I don't know what to do about that. It's in a cave, like fire is not really going to spread. If I had the plasma sword. You know, maybe. If I had a bunch of characters that could fire guns properly, maybe. Bugs are tricky, though. Hmm. I do have a lot of jellied chem fuel, and I thought I did have a flamethrower somewhere. Somewhere. I mean, maybe I sold it. Anything's possible. I don't see it.
shame. Flamethrower might have worked. I don't know. I guess let's just wait. The solution might make itself known. to build the mending station. We apparently need more components. That's why I have a lathe. Need a skill of 10. Shit. Harper's still short of that. That means we need to mine for components somewhere. <sighs> That's not likely. I've exhausted a lot. Here. Good. Something. Zombie attack. Lower right. Uh, experimental artificial creatures. Nano swarm mortar shell. Releases a swarm of compacted mechanoids on impact. That would be pretty fucking sweet if I had a mortar, but they're also in a mountain, so mortars... Nah. No, no. None of it's great. None of it's great. Alright, let's do this. The lowest. Alright, but if you could just finish, I mean, how would that go? If you just sat here and finished the job, wouldn't that be great? Industrial Supply Company. Good. Hippopotamus Revenge. Well, it certainly didn't get its revenge. Right, let's call this company up. What do we got? They've got components. That's probably good. Uh, Yeah, you know, the UAVs and stuff we were supposed to get. We need a drone station and the audio reels and AI, ch you know, all this stuff that I haven't gotten into yet. I think we're good on steel for the moment. Uh, can buy another high-tech research bench, but that's not really necessary. Mainly, though, we can just sell all our sculptures. All that hard artistic work. Purely for profit, baby. Anything else I want to buy here? Ooh, an automatic mason for making stone bricks, stone into bricks, or some reasonable looking art. That sounds kind of interesting. This can craft at a space skill level of five. It's kind of funny. So I wonder if it could just... If I could just park that and it could make drugs for me. This can mine steel. I 
$10,000. I can't afford that shit. I think buy this. Just to see how it goes. But see, that's why I want to get into all that automation. Probably be really cool. Why are we eating insect jelly at all? Why why is that part of the process? Fucking bugs. Okay. Clearly shouldn't have put it there. Put it like here. <sighs> okay, so we can make blocks. You don't even need prisoners, then. You just have industry. Um, That's it. I don't know where it mentions art or anything, but it can make blocks like nobody's business. I assume. Which works for me. There, create a stockpile zone. Uh, sort of. There we go. And this will just be for chunks. Import. That should move all blocks to that. Chunks to that. And now it's working. Look at it go. Hot damn. That is a block cutting machine. Holy shit. It's insane. It's an insane amount of... Yeah, that's already more blocks than he could ever really use. She could ever use. Actually, maybe I should have her be making grand sculpture. Try that. Cancel this. It is trash. You will make grand sculptures from now on. Uh, research product. Yeah. Uh, metal alloy barricades. Hollow deck. Advanced sorting system. Shields. All good things. Long range mineral scanner. No, 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 no. Uh, fine. I don't know if that's really a smart idea. Still don't have a solution for the bug. Ideally, I would be on better terms with the Empire, and I could just call in some military aid, but I'm not, and I don't remember why. No, I'm not going to go wrangle up some horse thief. This isn't Red Dead Redemption 2. need crafting oh okay crafting three to make five smoke trees. so yeah i could have gotten that machine and just parked it there and it would just make smoke leaf joints forever which is good
Okay. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Synth thread. Synth lean into, like, cotton or claw. Not bad idea. Shisa. The servers. Right. So I looked into this. I built that antenna, as you can see, so I can connect to the sky mine. And um, the thing I was specifically interested in was the skill computers. First of all, you basically have to keep the computer in a freezer. Like, you have to keep it at, like, 16 degrees. Otherwise, it overheats and can explode. <sighs> um, <coughs> and the skill computer generates skill points. The basic one that I had generated a max of 50 points. You can then connect to SkyMind and spend points to increase an Android's skills, which sounds awesome. Uh, but for, the, for those points, you need 300 points to increase one skill level by one for a Tier 1 Android. For the tier 4 Android Harper, I needed like 1,200 points. So basically, I would need six of those computers in order to generate enough skill points for one of my little androids to, to gain one skill. Um, for Harper to gain a skill, it would take I whatever that number is. 24 computers or something like that? Yeah, just absurd. Um... I, they would continue to generate them. It just maxes out at 50, so that's why you need so many computers. Uh, but then you get these better computers, I guess. It won't show me, like, their limit. But I assume it's at least 100. So, in theory, yeah. That, that was just the skill thing. I didn't look into the hacking one. Um, but it allows you to continually just improve your androids uh, over time, which is pretty cool. But I think for this setup, we're just going to take this and move on. <laughs> Give me some good stuff. Give me some fucking nukes or something. Yeah, this one will be pumping for a while. X33 is up to 1400. It's slow, you know? It's not like a super fast process to recharge. But, I mean, at the very least, our power problems are forever solved. Like, these power plants are so good. Come on, give me some good shit. Tier 2 androids! The time has come. Yes, research it. Yeah, you having fun there? I don't I don't know what to do about this. It really gets out of hand. It was out of hand when it started. done. No, Harper. Charge up. Get it done. Yes. Yes. Alright. Tier 2 Android. 10 gold, 50 plasteel, 16 components. That's a lot of components.
it's actually one less component to do the kit. <laughs> but no, we want... We want the android. Hmm. Okay. Need material? Yeah, components. Can't you read that crafting book? Shit. Okay, so he needs to gain crafting skill. What can I have him make? Maybe I can have him mend. Okay, that does... Yeah, it does increase crafting. Not very quickly. <laughs> Not very quickly at all. You gotta use up steel to do it. Let's say how much? It's just a nebulous number. Probably depends... I mean, what are my other options here? Is there anything else I can make? I can make various, like, parts. It's all components, though. We'd want to avoid that. I could make... Molotov cocktails. I could make railgun cartridges. But do I, you know, do I want to just sit here and make like 30,000 railgun cartridges? I don't know. Everything's components, damn it. Make napalm out of synthline and chem fuel, but that's wasteful. I could just make a billion upgrade kits. Uh, could make throwing knives. Could make riot shields, tool belts, ammo pack. I don't know. I, I don't know, man. Here, make some of this shit. <sighs> it's slow. Slow going, man. That whole riot shield was point zero two. Hold on, maybe uh maybe Reddit has some some good tricks. Uh uh clothing using cotton on an unpowered tailoring bench. Yes. I don't have cotton cloth, though. Well, I guess I have leather. Uh, I have quite a bit of leather. Okay. This is potentially viable. And Taylor bench out of steel. And we'll just put it right here in the middle. Uh, 
And uh, we need dusters. Those are the things to make. Uh, just make like 10 of them. Smoke your joint. And then make the dusters. This will get the skill going. Look at it go. Oh my god. I mean it is right. This is a very slow process. And that's what it's based on. Now where you now you got zombies over there. I still got zombies loitering around over here. Sylvester, why don't you go pop them? Huh. It seems like they actively avoid the napalm. I mean, I can't really blame them. I wouldn't want to walk through napalm next to a spark grid that just... There's a single, like, light switch preventing from <laughs> activating. Out of ammo... You motherfucker. That's interesting. No cat. All right, nine point four three. You still, you still go unload this, dude. No, do what I told you. There you go. Now you've got plenty. Now you gotta go help Robert and attack. Get over here and help Robert. So, they uh, keep mining out, which causes cave-ins, and they kill themselves, but it's never going to kill enough of them. So, it's a bummer. Uh, yeah, you can, you can shoot at this thing. No? My concern is you have a shield and you can't use your gun. That's my concern. And I was right. Yeah. So maybe don't use a shield. Anyways, what is Harper doing? No, 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 no. You gotta keep working on this. It's essential. Making a bunch of dusters will allow you to make an advanced android, all right? Don't question it. We need to get the second android, and then I can end the video. And I still don't know what I will do about this. It's just going to become worse and worse and worse. I wonder, I wonder if I couldn't, like, lay some napalm bombs right here. I wonder if we couldn't make this happen where I cook them in there. This is an, o an outdoor location, but if I wall it in... Hmm, this is kind of fascinating to me. Do something like that. I, eh, I don't know how close I can get. Maybe that's too close.
like if you did this while this saw while this saw you know i don't know and like put some napalm bombs here where they won't like quite aggro Put like I don't know and then just make like a Molotov or something toss it in there close the door behind you and then the, the temperature just gets up to like 2000 degrees in there because it's all locked in I don't know I don't know but I want to know I really want to know how's Harper coming along 9.63 Wild men wandering in. This guy. Come on, dude, just go through the napalm. Now the kill box slows us down even more. No, oh no, you're not. Oh no, you're not. Are you out of your fucking mind? You're gonna go all the way over there just to. No. Just make the dusters, dude. That's it. That's all I care about. We ran out of. Okay. But you can make patch leather. I don't know if I can make that much patch leather. Okay, make patch leather. No, you're still making patch leather. Good. Good. Still making patch leather. We had a lot of different types of leather. Now we can make the duster. It's getting close. No, I'm not going to... Kill a camp of junkers. I don't care about that. Close. Damn close. 9.84. Human revenge. You don't see that too often. Yeah, lucky. I think you're fucked. Nice shot. Point eight nine, point nine, point nine one, point nine two, nine three, nine four, nine five, nine six, nine seven. So close. Oh, he's got to start working on another duster. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99. 9.99
Yeah. Just do it. Shit, that's kind of worse. Yeah, because that's immediate bug. Kind of right outside my door. Where are you? Where? What are you doing? Okay, great. Come over here. You got infested ship chunks. You need material. Oh, yeah, that's the whole thing. We wanted to make components. <laughs> I forgot. Uh, 20. You'll get around to it. All right. Uh, sh shoot this shit. Oh, shit. Now shoot this shit. Okay, I mean, I'll acknowledge, I didn't think they would all pop out like that. Okay, uh, well, we're just clearing out tier one androids before I get tier two. I guess. Dice it. Where the fuck is my plasma sword? That's the biggest travesty. Yeah, see, this is what I wanted to avoid. And there goes another one. Alright, well, we're gonna... Start... Fr start fresh, I guess. Not quick to make a component. Still no? Oh, I was gonna... No. Uh, 14. I need 16. Yeah, okay. And we got a lot of bugs on the map now. They're in my way of dealing with the big bug problem, which is annoying. Graph self tame. Perfect. What am I going to do with that? Okay, Harper Jr., you weren't supposed... You weren't supposed to go out. Alright. Well, just Harper then. But now, we'll have a new... A new breed. Justin. All right. So, look at those skills. Shooting four, melee five, construction nine, crafting seven, art nine, social five. Yeah, it's not anything incredible, but it's better. It's better. Hmm. <clears throat> I'm not sure I can get to my gun. Yeah. Now I need... another 16 components. Nope, not gonna get to the gun. Alright, shit. Then get a different gun. Uh, inventory is full. Why is your inventory full? Your inventory is definitely not full. Why does it say stuff like that? You need to be on battery. Oh, fuck, Harper. 
Justin, you gotta save him. Go full auto on their asses. Shit. Harper should have some sort of melee weapon. We lost Justin. That's very pricey, I gotta say. These bugs are not good. Mace is not really cutting it. Harper's in a sad wander. I don't think that's good when you're being attacked by a fucking mega spider. But that's just my opinion. Okay, he's managed to put it down. Jarvis is dying of malnutrition. So that's good. This all went to shit very quickly. Alright, I think I'm going to reload and we're going to try all this again. <laughs> Sad to say. Um, that's a bit too much of a devastating loss to my overall productivity. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm not going to obviously reload before this because I want to deal with this. I think that will be really cool if I cook them all. So I'll make sure to try and get that on camera. But for now, my name is Mang. Game watching has been RimWorld. See you find folks in the next part.